So in astronomy, you know, the, the sun is 93 million miles away from the earth or 150 million kilometers. It's really, really far away. And I don't want to write 150 million all the time, right? Um, so we come up with a shorthand uh, to make this easier. Um, and it's the scientific notation. And it makes it sound like it's fancy, but all it means is we're too lazy to write these numbers a lot. So let's call it scientific notation. 1.5 times 10 to the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 times 10 to the 8. Okay, so that's 1.5 times 10 to the 8 just means 1.5 and then go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, so that's all that is. It's just a shorter way. Sometimes you'll see it uh, 1.5 e8, uh, just a different way to write it. Um, but that's just so you know you don't have to keep writing zeros all over the place because you don't really care about how many zeros there are. You care about this number and then the order of magnitude. So we would say 1.5 times 10 to the 8. That's the same as 150 million. Okay, so uh, another uh, unit that we're going to talk about numbers in astronomy, we measure distances using something called the light year. The light year is a distance. The light year is the distance that light travels in one year. So if you imagine taking a flashlight, okay, and clicking it on, bing, as soon as you turn it on, a light, we call them photons. Photons are the uh, individual component of light. Photons leave the flashlight, rays of light start to go out. Those rays of light fly off at light speed. You might ask yourself, where would the edge of that light ray be after uh, one year? Okay, so let's take our flashlight here, put it over there. We've got a rays of light. After one year, how far will it travel? Okay, it turns out to be 9 trillion kilometers. Okay, 9.5 times 10 to the 12 kilometers. That's a really far distance. That's a huge number. Um, the closest star is actually four light years away or 40 trillion kilometers. So, so we're going to be dealing with distances that are extremely uh, large. Okay, so 4.3 light years. Light year is a distance. It sounds like it's a time because it's got year in it. It's a distance, okay? So a light year is the distance that light travels uh, in one year. So what this means is that uh, Alpha Centauri, the closest star system, uh, it would take 4.3 years for light from Earth to reach that star or light from the star to reach us. Okay, so we think about it uh, in terms of um, it, it, when you started your first day of high school, you texted your friend, sent a text message to someone on Alpha Centauri, they would receive it the day you graduated high school, and they would send a reply and you would get it the day you graduate college, okay? So it would take eight years to send a signal to Alpha Centauri and get a response. Okay, so that's just a, that's the closest star to us, and that's um, how we think about distances. We think about it in terms of uh, the time it takes light, or the distance light travels in a year. Because the distances are so vast, 40 trillion kilometers, that we can't even think about it.